The Powerpuff Girls. A little monstrous problem. The city of Townsville, home of our favorite superheroes, the Powerpuff Girls. Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup were at the Pokey Oaks Kindergarten enjoying a peaceful day at school when suddenly the hotline rang. Beep, beep, beep. Powerpuff Hotline, what's the problem, Mayor? Oh, Blossom, said the Mayor. There's a terrible monster destroying the city. Come quick. We're on it, Mayor, Blossom replied and hung up the phone. Girls, Townsville's in trouble. Let's roll. The Powerpuff Girls flew through the air as fast as they could. When the girls arrived downtown, they saw that buildings had been ripped out of the ground and cars had been tossed aside. People were running scared. Let's find this monster, Blossom called to her sisters. All of a sudden, the girls heard a frightening sound. Rah! Get ready, girls, Blossom warned her sisters. Only a huge beast could do this kind of damage. But when the monster appeared, the girls were surprised to see that he wasn't huge at all. That's it, cried Buttercup. That tiny monster is causing all this damage? Oh, he's so cute, squealed Bubbles. Can we take him home? Are you crazy, asked Buttercup. That's a monster. We beat up monsters. Buttercup rushed to attack the beast, but when she reached out to punch him, the monster started playing patty cake. Then she tried to kick him in the belly, but as soon as her foot touched his tummy, the monster started giggling. How sweet! You're tickling him! laughed Bubbles. Buttercup was tired of this nonsense. Zap! She shot the monster with her laser eyes. This scared the monster and he ran away crying. What kind of monster is that? Buttercup asked. I've never seen a monster cry. But before the girls could figure it out, a huge flood of water came pouring down the streets of Townsville. The monster's tears have flooded the city, yelled Blossom. And sure enough, big monster tears were filling the streets. Let's get him, Buttercup called her sisters. Wait, Buttercup, he seems scared. Maybe there's a reason the monster is destroying the city, said Blossom. But then the girls heard cries from the people of Townsville. The monster tears were sweeping everyone away. Help! A man cried as his car floated down the road. Hold on, mister! I've got you! Blossom called out as she pulled the man from his car and flew him to safety. Bubbles! Over here! yelled a group of the girls' classmates. They were stuck in a whirlpool. Bubbles flew in and picked them up before the monster tears rose over their heads. Meanwhile, Buttercup hunted for the monster. When she found him, she got ready to attack, but Blossom stopped her. Wait a minute, Buttercup, said Blossom. I know we can't take the monster home like Bubbles wants, but we may not have to beat him up. We should try talking to him. What? Buttercup yelled. It's a monster. We're superheroes. Superheroes fight monsters. End of story. But Buttercup, maybe something is wrong, said Blossom. Just then Bubbles arrived. Can you talk to him, Bubbles? asked Blossom. I can try, Bubbles answered as she flew toward the monster. Bubbles understood many languages. She could even talk to squirrels. If anyone could talk to the monster, Bubbles could. The monster turned to run away from Bubbles, but when she started talking, he stopped. Ra ra ra. Bubbles said to the monster. The monster's eyes filled with tears. Ra 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 ra. The monster answered back. Ra. Bubbles replied. He's 
just a baby monster who has lost his way. He didn't mean any harm, Bubbles told her sisters. A baby? No wonder he's so small, said Blossom. But he still destroyed our town, Buttercup grumbled. It was an accident, Buttercup. He was looking for his mother, Bubbles said. Let's take him to his family. So Blossom, Bubbles, and even Buttercup picked up the lost little monster and flew him home. All the other monsters on the Isle of Monsters were happy to see him. Rah, 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 the king monster said to the girls. Rah, 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 Bubbles answered back. What did the king monster say, Bubbles? Buttercup asked later. He thanked us for bringing the monster home and offered to help us clean up our city, Bubbles answered. I said thanks, but we've had enough of monsters in Townsville for one day. Blossom and Buttercup laughed and laughed along with their sister. So once again, the day was saved, thanks to the Powerpuff Girls. The end.